Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Donnie, and you're watching Diamond Painting by Donnie. I'm doing a little bit of an unboxing here, mainly because I need a freshly folded canvas that's come in. I don't know why this is zoomed in so far. It's normally not this... I don't know what happened. Oh, I adjusted things when I did my live, so this should be okay because they're pretty small. Um, this, these are kind of weird because I don't have a package for them. I don't remember um, what kind of a package they came in, when they came in, because I always put on the package the date that it comes in. However, um, they were just sitting out, hanging out with all my other diamond paintings, and there was nothing on them. So I don't know when they came in. Anyway, um, I bought them on AliExpress from a company called Shenzhen Super Deal Company Limited. They were $3.02 and two cents each. And they go along with one of the other ones that I've already unboxed. And I will link that video for that unboxing right up there. So the first one I opened, I think, was the Summer Tree. It was rhinestones. Um, this one here, I believe, is Spring. And it's also supposed to be rhinestones, which it looks it is by the way the symbols are. So let's open it up. I'm, oh goodness. I or, I'll, I'll at least tell you when I ordered them. I ordered it January 6th and they shipped them January 8th and that's all the information I have. All I know is it's rhinestone and special drills, uh, 30 by 30, and I only paid three dollars and two cents for it. All right, so yeah, this has got some good wrinkles. All right, so this came with the, pl the big plastic tweezers, which um, I give these away with my blue trays. And I think I actually have enough. I could probably give them away with each of the trays. I don't know. Let me know if that's something that you guys would like if you bought a tray. If I included the big plastic ones. Because these are supposed to be good for rhinestones and rounds sometimes. Um, so basic kit. It's not often that you get tweezers with a round. Alright, I don't know why I'm pulling out the diamonds already. I normally don't do that until after the canvas. But I... I You've probably already seen the video where I try out the new method for getting rid of wrinkles. And in that video, I let you know that I'm going to do an unboxing real quick so that I can get me some wrinkled canvases. So this is what I was referring to. So I was so intent on getting this canvas, I totally forgot to show you what it looks like, huh? So this is spring, at least in my opinion, this is spring. And we do have, it's a bit... Uh, There we go. Uh, I can't handle the big wrinkles on here, on the top. It just feels wrong to me. All right. So it has 10 colors. Um, it looks like only six of them are colors. The rest are uh, special shapes. So here's what this looks like. This canvas is pretty thin. And I like these that have the cutouts on the corners so it helps you with doing framing. Um, if you've watched my um, framing of the rhinestone horse that I put up on my wall, uh, it I also had these and they helped a lot. Here, I'll link that up here as well, right there in that eye. All right, so here, let me show you the drill field. I mean, there's some pretty small symbols there. But they're easy to read. It, I think it may look like there is more to drill here than there really is because of the background color on the tree. Uh, but I like that even the little insects here have um, diamonds put on them. This right here, this black, no, that's not one, I don't think. No, okay. There's a symbol in here that, see, here's the key, number um, six how it's got that black um, shape. It kind of almost looks like you would put that here on this flower, 
but you don't. It's meant for uh, the area that's inside of the red one there. But there is still quite a bit to do on this. I am pleasantly surprised. For $3, people say they can't afford it um, to get diamond paintings. You just have to know where to look. Um, watch these videos. I, I am a big um, supporter, or whatever the word is, of finding inexpensive, beautiful paintings. And this being one of them. I probably would not put these on my wall. I will probably put them in my portfolio. This would actually go in my um, smaller portfolio because it is a 30 by 30. My larger one is for ones that are bigger. So let's look at these drills. The rhinestones, there are six colors. We've got silver. Here, let me turn my light this way so we can see the shine on them better. There we go. Okay, so there's silver. Come on, focus. There we go. And a ruby red. Wow, that's pretty. And then we've got a... Oh, I don't know what to call that. Maybe a magenta. Yeah, there we go. And then we have just plain black, which is not a rhinestone color. It's just a regular 310. And then we've got... Uh, a, a light lavender pink and beautiful purple love the purple I love that there's not a lot of colors to drown it out um, but it's interesting because the blacks don't say 310 on them um, they say 93 um, it's just interesting that it's considered the number 93. Maybe they're using some other chart for it. I don't know. Very interesting. Okay. And then we've got the, there are four special shapes in this one. And number seven is S2, which is this beauty right here. And I'm going to keep my hand up here so it doesn't have to refocus. Um, number eight is YX101. Oh, those are pretty. Look at those. That beautiful pink color. Does it have, um, I thought it had some AB coating on it. Maybe it does kind of have a, a shimmer to it. It looks like it might have a little bit of an AB coating on it. Come on, you can do it. You can focus. Let's sit here like this. I offer up to you the camera. My, you know, come on. Okay, there we go. You can kind of see it there. I mean, it's reflecting off of the bottom of the silver. Yeah. Um. The next one is YX136. Okay, so we have um, some silver teardrops. And the last one are these pink, pink lavender, no, not lavender, but pinkish purple uh, teardrop shapes. So that's this one, nice and wrinkled for my demonstration. And now let's look at, the next one is winter. And same thing, same price, paid $3.02. And let's see how many colors are in this one. Looks like 11. So there's one extra, and it looks like it's an extra um, special shape because they have the special symbols, 7, 8, 9, 10, and 11. So five of them. Now this one's not as wrinkled as that first one. It does have the creases. So I might just try it on both of them. Um, same kit. Um, it doesn't have any black in this one. Unless they get, yep, they gave it a different number. It's still black. 
That's so interesting how they do that. So this is just basically their numbering system, apparently. It's not the actual uh, rhinestone DMC colors. Because <coughs> somewhere out there, there is a chart for the rhinestones. And I have a chart, but let me see here. See if I can remember where I put it. Okay. I have this DMC Stones book I got off AliExpress. And all it has are names. There are no numbers whatsoever assigned to them. There's some really I mean, this will tell you what the names of them are. They even have the AB coded ones in here. So black, it's just jet black. So there is, it's funny how they actually have a specific for rhinestones, a uh, black color. See there? Jet black right there. There we go. But these ones that are missing, they said there are none in that color so far. But, I don't know. Some really pretty colors like cobalt. Oh, beautiful. Um, trying to see some of these purples. Like, I know I'm getting off on a tangent, but let's take this color, for instance. That looks like um, light sapphire. Yep. Or capri blue. It's close. Um, it's not AV coded, so it wouldn't be down here. So it would be one of those. Yeah, it looks like it's Capri Blue. And they actually have Black Diamond. So that's interesting because it's like a see-through black, whereas this is solid. Anyway, so let me pull the cover back, get these wrinkles out. I like that they don't have the entire area covered in stickiness, only the areas that require um, gems. I've, I, my last one that I did, that, that horse, it actually had adhesive over the entire thing, even over areas that didn't get um, gems put on it. And I don't like that because it's just means that it was something I needed to frame in order to keep all the dust and the grime from, or pollen and whatnot hairs from floating into it and sticking to those areas in between the drills. So here, I'll show you the drilling area. Same, same with this one. It's um, nice and thin. It's got the corner marks for framing. And there is our key. Nice and big to read. Nice size to read. This is perfect for living room projects. So that, now I'll actually officially show you the colors. There's actually six special shapes. This only has four gem colors. And we've got three different blues and the black. So there we go. There's one blue. And I believe that's probably a uh, sapphire. And I think this one here is cobalt. And then that's light sapphire. And see, it says 93 on this one for the black. The other one says, oh, it does say 93. I don't know. Oh, because it has a zero in front of it. Well, so does the other one. I don't know. I got thrown off. It's actually the same exact symbol. It's the plus sign. But that other one is in pink, and this one has a green circle around it. Anyway, same manufacturer, obviously, um, because this says DZ03. Three, four, and that says DZ035. So that leads me to believe, since this is obvious it's winter, that this one is spring. And I'm not sure what the canvas number is on the one that I called summer, but if it was the same manufacturer, I would guess that it would say uh, 36. But I had to order from different companies for the reasoning that I think one of them they didn't have everything, so I had to go with a different company. They didn't have all four. So I actually went with three different companies, I believe, to get all four of them. I still have not opened um, Autumn. I'm not sure which package it's in, so we'll find out. 
one of these days. All right, so we let's pull out the six special drills here. Of course, they've got the blue teardrop as like the other one where it's pink. This one's are blue. This one's these ones. And this looks like it, it's got a beautiful holographic sheen to it. This teardrop, this silver one here. Camera does not want to focus today. There we go. I think. Yeah, look at that. Look at that shine. Oh, it's so pretty. And then, oh my gosh, look at this one. Look at that. It's like a teal, aqua, aqua blue, whatever you want to name it. I could actually probably look it up, see what color that is. That's so pretty. Um, I'm not sure if it even had, well, because it's not a rhinestone, it's, um, because they're special shapes, I, it doesn't fit in with the coloring. Well, it looks kind of like the aquamarine. It's a little more greenish, but I love it. And then there's, here's a larger teardrop that definitely has an AB coating on it. In... Uh, gosh, it's just a, it's a lighter blue than this one. These are so pretty. Oh my gosh. And then it's got the silver ones, which I'm not going to wait for it to focus. Those are the same as that's in the other one. And then here is one. Oh, the, all the ones that are face up to where the label is. The, that has an AB coating on it. And they are... Oh man, some look like they're pur oh yeah, see different different way you tilt it, it looks either purple or blue. That is just beautiful. And then last but not least, these are like these are pearl A B pearl half pearls. Look at that. I have it faced up this way because most of them are turned over. So look at that. So I am extremely impressed with the price of what these cost for three dollars and two cents. This is this is worth more than, in my opinion, worth more than three dollars. So it was definitely worth the buy, and I just wish I had knew where the packaging was for it. Um, the only reason I know who who it's from is because. Um, this is the only thing I've ever ordered from that company, and it was these two paintings. So, it had to be that company. I had chili for dinner, so I'm, I've am i got some indigestion, so I can't... Trying not to let it sound out on the video. But anyway, this is a thumbs up for me. I definitely would purchase these again. And now I'm going to... I'm doing a video. What do you need? Oh, I actually went away. <clears throat> Excuse me. So, yeah. Um, check them out. If they are still selling it, I don't know. I don't know. But I'll give you the link to the these listings. And hopefully they still have them. If you're interested in buying a $3 rhinestone painting. You know, I've been really attracted to rhinestone paintings uh, at this point when I ordered these. I have a ton more that I haven't unboxed yet. So this is a great way to start. They're all really good price too, so I can't wait to show them to you. If you liked this video, please um, hit that thumbs up button. And I will see you guys in my next video. Have fun diamond painting. And as always... Don't forget to sparkle wherever you go and whatever you do. Take care, everyone. Bye.